What up, guys? What's up? Welcome to another episode of Sneakerhead Two and Three. Before I move forward, as always, hit the like button, comment down below after watching this review. Let me know what you thought about it. Follow me on IG at Empresario underscore three one seven. Hit the notification bell and let's get started. So today we have a really much anticipated review. I've been excited about this review ever since I saw the prices on these shoes. Um, so these are the Nike Air Max ninety seven. The official colorway is light blue slash pink quartz. Um, and it's, this is a size nine and a half because these are true to size. Um, from what I heard, this was an overseas release. Um, and these are actually the Air Max 97 corduroy uh, pack release. So there was two colorways I released. Um, here's this from StockX because I didn't buy these from StockX. Um, and that's how much I paid for it. Um, and there's the StockX stickers. And another one for whatever reason. So... Um, let's see, I just want to make sure I go in over everything. Okay, so yeah, so here they are guys. Here are the shoes. Very clean shoes, very interesting. Um, this was the color that I prefer. The other one was like a primary desert sand. They're calling these the light blue colorway. And this was just a colorway that I thought was a little bit more um, masculine, but very clean shoes. Um, they pay a nod and homage to the Witherspoon Air Max 98s. See, check that out. Look at that. Very, very clean shoe nonetheless. Um, and yeah, I just had my eyes on these. I meant to get these sooner, like very, very much sooner, considering these released back in November 30th of 2019. So a little bit over a year ago. Um, not a year ago, sorry, just a few months ago. Um, but yeah, this is something that I had in the back of my mind and my radio and my radar, but I got busy with some things and I just, it just slipped my mind. And then I was just looking at StockX and these just randomly popped up. And yeah, ever since then I had these, um, in my radar and I decided to, you know, kind of, you know, buy them. So anyways, long story short, I'm excited I got these. Um, it took them a while to ship because of how things are right now with that coronavirus mess. And so um, make sure you sanitize your boxes before you open them. Um, make sure you wash your hands even after touching the shoes. <laughs> um, because the virus can still sit on surfaces for quite a while. But this is not a virus review or any you know advice. This is a shoe sneaker review. Um, but nonetheless, this is the light blue Air Max 97 um, corduroy uh, colorway. Very much um, inspired by the Sean Witherspoon Air Max 98s. Um, since I didn't get my hand on those, I decided to get my hand on these. This is more of like a casual wear spring slash summertime shoe. I can picture someone, you know, wearing these at the beach, you know, in, in, in Miami or on vacation. You know, it'd be kind of cool because of the colors. They're warm colors and they're like beach style, you know, vacation colors, seasonal colors per se. Um, but yeah, what you see here is predominantly a upper that's composed of corduroy, different colors, the light blue here. They have the, uh, this is almost like a, um, an off-white almost. Um, and then you have this darker gray here, which is pretty cool with the 3M hints there. And of course on these, you know, the 3M hints look pretty nice once the light hits it at night. Um, and then you have the tongue also that is in that very um, pastel pink um, corduroy material. Um, you have the heel tab here. I mean, sorry, the pull tab here on the tongue with the Air Max brand. I mean, the Nike swoosh brand there. And it has corduroy material there and then just a stitch pink um, swoosh. And then it has this right here. This uh, design here, which is pretty much like a shoelace holder um, for the laces. And it is also 3M. Um, the laces are just your regular round uh, rope laces with the aglets there being a darker blue, almost like a hyper blue. Um, and then the inner inner liner of the shoe is an orange and it's made of fabric. Yeah, it's, it's a fabric material. Um, and then the insole is just pain and complementing the colors of the tongue and the predominantly light blue upper and mid associate right there. So it's pretty cool. It's like a pink dolphin. Um, if you guys know about pink dolphin, the brand, 
that's what it kind of reminds me of this colorway air max heel uh tab here with air max branding there and the pink there and then that's pretty much it guys the nike switch there on the midsole the midsole is light blue as well the air bubble unit there is in gray and even on the back and then the outsole is just your regular air max 97 outsole with the hyper blue i might be wrong i don't know what kind of blue that is the black and then like a turquoise here and then right there that little uh branding there of nike swoosh and pink and then the light blue on the background then pink there and more black but all in all a really nice shoe guys there's a nike swoosh there as well really nice shoe i like it um i probably will sell these though <laughs> I wanted to do these more for review, so I, yes, I bought these just for the review. Um, but you know, if I was into you know wearing pink and you know these kind of colors that can cross the thin line of rather it's feminine and masculine, then I would rock these. But you know me, I'm not gonna be wearing these shoes with a pink tongue on them. You know, that's just if you if you can't, then uh, you know more to you. But I can't. Anyways, these are really nice. I like the material. That's what I appreciate most. The material, the colorway is pretty cool and different. Um, but yeah. Let me know if you're interested, size nine and a half. I'll give you a really good price. Other than that, comment down below if you like this shoe. Let me know your thoughts. Follow me on IG at Empresario underscore 317. And we'll see you guys on the next review. Peace.